If I had to describe the Department of Economics and Statistics in three words, I would say cohesion, independence, diversity. The first two need no explanation, whereas diversity is a feature of our lines of research, approaches and thought. These characteristics allowed us to achieve good research outcomes, as confirmed by the last evaluation of research quality carried out by the National Agency for the Evaluation of the University. Inequality means differences concerning, among the other things, opportunities and resources like income and wealth. Economists usually study inequality between countries and within them, which means among people. Within the Department of Economics and Statistics, scholars explore inequality by drawing on economic theory, by developing new statistical methodologies and new data, and studying economic history in the long run. Therefore, we provide policy-relevant results like new indicators for measuring inequality, inequality trends and their determinants in a historical perspective and a better understanding of the multiple dimensions of poverty and inequality. Global environmental challenges require to find an equilibrium between economic growth, environmental quality and social sustainability, both at local and global level. Our department leads cutting-edge research at the frontier of economics and statistics, addressing a variety of issues. Our researchers analyze the social and environmental impacts of technological change, design appropriate policies for a sustainable economic development, use new and advanced statistical techniques for an accurate quantification of environmental dimensions. Our most recent projects involve participation in international network, offering contribution that meets the needs of citizens, businesses and governments. Every course I teach, the first day of class, I always start by asking students what are the main similarities between social insects and humans. The answers are always fascinating. But my main point is to highlight that we don't live alone. We interact and we are constantly in an interconnected world. And that is what economics is about for me. It's about understanding these mechanisms of interaction and cooperation. Cooperation between small groups, cooperation between large groups, to understand critical decisions, such as what to produce, how to produce, how to distribute what was produced. Cohesion, independence, diversity. This has distinguished us in the past and I hope will continue to do so in the future.